But did more people die when Rajiv Gandhi was assassinated than what was officially declared? Now, there is a strong possibility that at least two more could have lost their lives. Twenty years after the tragedy, two sisters are on a mission to find out if their parents uh, too fell to the pellets at uh, uh, the assassination site. Investigators also say it is possible. Sam Daniel sent us this exclusive report. Often in childhood, these sisters are trying to find out if their parents died in the bomb blast that killed Rajiv Gandhi. At the children's home they grew up in, they were told their parents, both Congress workers, died in the Sri Parambadur blast. With the official list of 18 casualties not mentioning their parents, they are now on a fact-finding mission. My father's name is Arjunan, my mother's name is Saudri. NDTV has access certificates issued by this children's home which very clearly say that the parents of these siblings were killed in the blast that took the life of Rajiv Gandhi. Authorities in this children's home refused to speak on camera but they confirmed the sisters' version. They also cite similar unrecorded casualties in the case, that they brought up seven such orphans. The man who investigated this high-profile case does not rule this out. They have got the injury or something like that, later on gone to some place and got admitted and uh, without even reporting the possibilities there. We cannot rule it out. 20 years on, there are families still looking for answers that only further investigation can provide. In Chennai with camera persons Edwin and Sukumar, Sam Daniel, Find the TV. NDTV's cricket app, Android and iPhone, faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.